I am humbled to be receiving an honorary degree uh, later today from this distinguished university. There is so much that sets Trinity College apart. Your rigorous scholarship, your diversity, your long history of producing some of the world's most influential leaders, change makers, artists, entrepreneurs. And at the heart of it all is an understanding that a Trinity education is not simply about learning within the four walls of a classroom, but about contributing to society and our world. It's about encouraging students to think for themselves, to take risks, to embrace the spirit embodied by one of your graduates, Samuel Beckett, who summed up his work this way, ever tried, ever failed, no matter, try again, fail again, fail better. <laughs> uh, believe me, those are words to live by for anyone. As I followed the recent referendum, I saw Irish people flying home to vote from all over the world. The airports were mini rallies with cheering and colorful banners, greeting citizens who came as far away as from Japan, Australia, and of course, America. And on the day of the vote, one of the strictest laws in the world was overturned with nearly 87% of 18 to 25 year olds voting yes. An example of a government placing that decision before the people and grassroots activism leading to an outcome that represented the voices and views of the Irish people. In our democracies, every citizen should believe in his or her power to make a difference, even when that difference looks like it will be hard to achieve. And every citizen should vote in every election, even when our side loses. It is a matter of infinite faith. And we need to, yes, pace ourselves, lean on each other, celebrate the heroes, encourage all of us to disagree respectfully, be ready to lose some fights that are worth waging. We will need to try again, fail again, and fail better. Let's get to work. Thank you.